myself. And there really isn't anything I did different to it. You know, with uh, other stuff I've made, I've kind of, you know, added in a little different things to kind of give it a different flavor, whether it be a little bit of pumpkin butter, mix it up. This is pretty much straight to the recipe. Actually, I changed my mind. I lied. I um, I'm lied to you guys. I actually put regular milk in this because I made it at my mom's house where I had the option there. And it is just delicious. I mean, first off, you got to look at this. This is the only piece that is left over. This is all that's left of the pumpkin bread. Libby's homemade pumpkin bread. This is, and it's got a thick tenderness. This is already days after it's been made. And it's still moist, it's still juicier. It really, I would say it's on par with the me because that's how good it is. My family ate the rest of it. I mean, throughout Pumpkin Fest, I've pretty much been doing this on my own, aside from uh, my guest host with the beers earlier in the month of October. I have not had a chance to um, really review with anybody because pumpkin, as hyped as it gets, not a lot of people actually really genuinely like the actual pumpkin and everything that comes with it, the good and the bad. And I was really caught off guard when my entire family ate up the entire thing. This is all I could bring with me. Well, I had a little half of uh, one of the loaves. It makes two loaves. And half of the loaf that I was able to take with me of one of the loaves, this is all that's left. Um, nobody at my work picked it, thank God. That is not a good place, but I mean, sorry I'm all over the place, but I'm pretty excited to finish off this bread. So if you look really close, one thing I like about the bread is just so textured. There's just so much there. You can see the spices when you look up close. It has a nice color to it. Almost a week later made. If, um, it comes with a real, the ingredients list in the box comes with one can of real pumpkin. And I made the muffins earlier this month, and I felt like using the muffins in there, using the pumpkin in there, the can, whole pumpkin, as opposed to pumpkin puree, I really kind of kept it from cooking all the way. But for some reason, this one, you don't really get that sense of glob of whole pumpkin. Like, this is legit, genuine, great bread. Like, this is some of the best pumpkin bread I've had, and the fact that it's homemade... I don't know if maybe I made it. I would have messed up on it more, but my mom did fantastic with this. Let me put the picture right there again for you guys to see. Got this at Walmart. I believe they sell it at Target, too. I am probably going to pick up another one of these before the end of the year. And then, yeah. Mm. This might be my worst review yet. I'm being honest with you guys, unfortunately, like with all of Pumpkin Fest, everything seems to fall apart, but, you know, I want to review everything, something different I can to you guys, and this is as new as it gets, and it's honestly one of the best things I've got. It's definitely cheaper than, cheaper than, um, a venti pumpkin cream cold brew at Starbucks. It's a whole two loaf bread. You could feed a family with this. I can't, oh my God, this is one of the best pumpkin items of the year. I mean, is it the best taste you Is it the best tasting? No. But it's more... Is it the cheapest? No. But we've already learned about getting cheap products from those uh, snaps. Let's stay away from the cheap. But this is honestly... It's a good medium price. Gives you a lot... Huge portions for it. And the flavor is just awesome. Even when I ate it the day after. I actually kind of like it days after than I did the day of. It's kind of like gotten more moisture... Especially after leaving it in the fridge for two days. But yeah, Libby's Pumpkin Bread Kit. Absolutely awesome. I mean, unless you somehow get different milk or different eggs, I don't see how your bread could come out any different. So there's a good chance you're going to be eating what I'm eating right now. And if you are, you're a lucky person because this is delicious. All right, sorry for the awful pumpkin fest, but you know what? If you haven't learned, expected that at this month. <clears throat> So yeah, do yourself a favor, pick up the uh, Libby's Pumpkin Bread. It is cheap, it is awesome, it is delicious, and it'll keep you full all season long. Damn. Kind of wish I made three loaves now that I'm done with it. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Pumpkin Fest out.